I am Anil Kumar. We are learning how to multiply polynomials. In this particular video, we have taken two trinomials. The question here is expand and simplify 2x plus y minus 2 times x minus y plus 3. Now, multiplication of polynomials follows the same steps. So, in this case, we have 2x plus y minus 2 times x minus y plus 3. We are multiplying two trinomials, you understand? So, so the first step will be with 2x multiply all the numbers in the second trinomial. So, it is 2x times x minus y plus 3 and then multiply by plus y x minus y plus 3 and then by minus 2. So, minus 2 times x minus y plus 3, correct? So, now we'll apply the distributive property, multiplying each term by the term outside. 2x times x will give us 2x square. 2x times minus y is minus 2xy. 2x times plus 3 is plus 6x. Now, we'll do with y. It is good to write x first and then y, okay? xy minus y square plus 3y multiplying by minus 2 gives us minus 2x always the constants come before the variable plus 2y and minus 6. At this stage we should combine the like terms right. So let's look for like terms and combine them. 2x square we do not have any x square so we have 2x square here now xy terms so we have uh, some xy terms let's look into those so this is one xy then we have another xy here so we'll combine these two minus 2xy plus xy will give us minus xy okay then we have x term here so we do have two x terms 6x is one x term then we have minus 2x correct so combine these two, 6x and minus 2x will give us plus 4x. It is good to mark them so that we don't miss out on any, right? So now the next term, we have already taken care of xy minus y square. So there are no y square terms other than this. So we have minus y square. How about y terms? So we have two y terms, 3y and 2y. Adding them gives us 5y, right? Now the constants, the only constant is minus 6, minus 6, right? So that is how we get our equation. Now we can kind of rearrange it. So normally when you rearrange, we rearrange with powers of x decreasing right and y increasing that is kind of a way but here we have two variables uh, this is also good enough so we could kind of write like this 2x square powers of x is kind of here we'll write this as minus xy plus 4x and then we'll write plus 5y minus y square minus 6 constant may come at the end so that is how we could actually expand and simplify the product of two trinomials. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.